everyone welcome back to my channel and today I decided to redo my bathroom with some different decor and I have already made this vase and I'm gonna show y'all how see how pretty they look um, how I made these okay but I'm gonna make something different today and that's just part of my decor I found this bottle here from the Dollar Tree. And um, and I, the reason why I picked it because it has a little leaf in it. And my vase has the leaf in it also. So this is going to kind of come together to what I already have. So, and I'm also going to redo this little vase here. And I'm going to use it just for decoration. So I'm going to redo it also today. I have to use some of my little gins that I already had. And I decided to go ahead and just put them all up to the neck of it. And I already have started it. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to put a few of them on. And then I'll be back with the rest of it. And then we're going to get to painting. So I'm just going to add a few of these. So we're going to start with the black first. And I'm going to put in the description box below everything I am using. And at first, it's going to be kind of real light black, but it'll get better. Because we probably want to put at least about two coats. Okay, I finished painting this one. Now I'm going to set this one aside. And then we're going to start painting our other bottle. And I love this one also because it has the little little ridges on it. And you'll see all that after we get to painting. Can't hardly see it now. So we're going to go ahead and paint this. This is an old bottle I've been having a long, long time. It's probably about 20 years old. And I wouldn't dare throw it away. And I did this project here a while ago. I just glued these two glasses together. They made this, it was pretty like it was, but I just wanted to update it some. And I always pick a, a glass that has uh, dimensions in it. Don't just put, pick one that's straight. It's not no kind of design whatsoever. Try to find you one with design in it that got different dimensions, squirrels, uh, rectangles. That way that your face will stand out. Okay. That's just a tip. Now, I'm going to finish this and I'll be back. I have put on my second coat. And so I'm going to let this dry for about an hour and see how beautiful see the detail of the of the glass world that is so pretty see the detail with the little bees in it and all that it looks nice now i could stop right now if i wanted to and it would still be pretty but i want to put at least two more different colors in it to really bring it out now i am going to do my silver I'm going to paint it over the black. I'm just going to do these and scrubs down. Okay, I'm going to finish this. Okay, I have painted all over, but I'm going to go back with this brush because I want to take some of that silver out. The black can show through it also. So I'm going to take this same brush I'm just going to go through it. Then I'm going to paint some right here at the top here so y'all can see. Okay, I'm going to just put a little bit of silver in there. But leave some of the black. Hope y'all can see that. I want to leave some of the black in there. See how that pretty that's looking though? That is so pretty. 
It just make the bottle look like it's just really, really old. And this just kind of like a dry brush. I'm just kind of brushing some of that gray out of there so I can see some of the black. Isn't that pretty? Okay, I'm gonna finish doing this. Then I'm gonna do my other bottles. And then we'll come back and do one more color. stress I like that but we're gonna come back and do one more color we're gonna put some gold on them and then I'll be right back I'm gonna let these dry just a little bit between colors and then we're gonna come back we're gonna put a little gold and that gold gonna bring it out real good okay so now we're gonna put a little shade of gold in there and we're going to use this little flat brush because we don't want it just to go just right there over the, the high part that's up. The little bees, we just want to just touch it just a little bit, just to get a little, just to get a little gold. See around these ridges here, these ridges right here. I'm just going to kind of paint over just a tab. Just a little tab, a little gold. See that little gold? I'm putting my putting lash just a little bit. Okay, so I'm just kind of doing the last one here. Okay, so this is the final results. What y'all think? I think they look amazing. 